Oh, you know I'm going to have to review this piece of fuck. Yeah, you know what I did? You know, I should have done this a long time ago. But, I can't. Because I have to review it first. Damn, I was getting excited for a brief moment. Sonic 6 is the worst 360 game. It's good. The graphics are good. The only thing is just... Yeah, it just has weird glitches. What do you think is the worst NES game? I got a few, but... You know, I really can't say. What do you think Nintendo's new console is going to be? I know we're making a new Switch, but that's not a new console. Hmm. It's something to look into. You know, I wonder what um, the new Xbox gonna, new Xbox is going to be. Right now I'm just calling it the Xbox Scarlet, but... thing that makes this game positive, and you're thinking, none. This game is supposed to be based off the 1966 TV series, which was amazing. I mean, it wasn't around in 66, but I did see some reruns. So, how bad can it be? It's based off that maiden TV show. How bad can it be? Uh, yeah, how bad can it be? <sighs> I might have to take that back, but... There's only one way to find out. Let's do it. Uh, can't believe I'm doing this. Can't believe I'm doing this. one thing wrong. Everyone else is going to be wrong with this game. Seriously, I have all consideration. You are... This game is ruining one of the best anime TV shows of all time. It's ruining it. I don't mean to be picky, but...
is this. Games like this, it, games like this feels like your control is broken, you know what I mean? Oh, come on. No. Mm. Good friend. Now, he. Now, my good friend. He's professional. He's professional. 
professional when it comes to animation, Marvel characters, and games. Both of us are, but he's a professional with almost everything. He's a professional with games, animation, Marvel, superheroes, supervillains, and everything. I might want to call him and ask him what's going on here. This game is so bad. You know, I I'd rather be playing Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Yeah. Because that's a bad game. That's, a, that's probably one of the worst games of all time. But, but, okay. Now, Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde is a playable game. Not so much. Now, let's talk about three really, really bad games besides this. Besides this. Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. The Wizard of Oz. The Wizard of Oz was really neat game, though. Whatever. I don't own it, so. That's. Now. Okay, so. Mr. Foss, don't joke, okay, Mr. High. Uh, I think they're really, not really that game. I was in, I don't know, some bad thing, I don't know. You know what? I just saw something. This is for a totally different. I, uh, that game, uh, um, uh, that Michael Jackson game, I don't know, something, I don't know. But it's not a job. It's a really old game. I don't own it. So those are three really, really bad games. Yeah. Three of them are really bad. Okay? Dark Side is high. Was about that Michael Jackson game. Okay? Now, all of them are playable. You know, all of them are playable. Dark Side is high. You're doing something. You're like shooting things. That when you, uh, um, it, it's been like five years since I played it. I actually had, I had played it. Yes, it's true. Now, all three of those are playable. This is not playable. This should never. This should never exist. The worst games of all time. Even the Ghostbusters game. That was playable. This. Splinter Rings. You know what this one assembles to? You know what. You know what this is like? You know what would be even better? This, not even better. Better as in a bad way. This. They made a game like this. You know. It should have been like. It's just like Superman walking through kindergarten. You're interacting with little kids and playing hopscotch. But enough of that. Those three really bad games are playable. This is not. So, I'm gonna call. See what's going on. And I'm gonna ask him number one. First thing I'm gonna ask him is, What's with the fuck is dark music? Oops, hold on. Okay, now, one thing, one, just one, okay, one thing, you know, I'm so pissed off, I totally forgot, shit, <sighs> crap, damn, all right, that's what I was going to say, now, they made the same exact game for the original PlayStation. Now I heard that one's a lot smoother. A lot smoother. I then I just saved myself a couple hundred emails just by saying that. The controls are a lot easier. I mean, it's like it's almost like the this pretty original PlayStation that came out first, then this. I just keep the one for the PlayStation and it's playable. I heard the one for the PlayStation is playable. Yeah. Yeah. I think 
think the only problem with this is the joystick. Like if you have now let's place this controller. Now look how loose this is compared to this. Yeah. Maybe that's why you But why would you choose why can't it be the D pad? Because this is so loose, you're like flying everywhere. Now it's on call. As to what the fuck is going on. Let's see what he has to say. I, I hate myself right now. Not one more time. One more time. Now, I really, I, I'd rather be playing Doctor Zelda Mr. Hard than this. It's a very insane for me to say that. It's insane for me to say. It. Well, it's true. Yeah. One more time. This time I'm actually up. Continue sense, continue sense. It's around like that time I, I just try to put this in the three in the ten six whatever. I think I'll go and see what the fuck is going on here.